Everybody wants something different when they're coming to Montana. Of course they want to catch fish, but some people want to throw dry flies. Some people want to float in a boat. Some people want to wade fish. Some people want to have a low cost trip. Some people want to stay at an all-inclusive lodge. So we want to listen to our guests and find out what exactly they're looking for as their perfect trip. And then we go to work trying to craft that experience. Montana Angler came about through my own guiding experiences, both here in Montana and, and in other states. And what, uh, what I found I really enjoyed was fishing all different kinds of water, small stream wading, floating big rivers, technical spring creeks, hopper fishing. The real beauty of fishing in Montana is this amazing diversity. I really wanted to bring that to all of our guests to showcase this amazing variety of fishing and have them appreciate this amazing wild place every day of their trip. Having grown up in Montana as well as Wyoming uh, on a cattle ranch, fishing for me was always an escape to uh, get out of work. So I would, could always find uh, some place that nobody else could find. And that's what I love about Montana is the hidden places, the off the beaten path places. It's a lot of fun to take somebody who's maybe never been to Montana and go sneak them through some tall grass to plop a hopper down in front of a wild brown trout or take them on a float down one of our big classic rivers. You know, it, it, it feels good to show people that. We view a successful trip as one, not just where folks have fun, enjoy the trip, catch fish, but where their expectations are blown away they learned a lot more about the sport of fly fishing. They made memories that will last a lifetime and they'll have this sinking feeling when they go home wondering when's the next time I can get back to Montana.